did was my show. That is very cool. But also realizing that the skills that we have are for everyone, that we share our knowledge, and that's what it, what organizations like the National Academies do. The best engineers in the United States, and of course around the world, work together for the betterment of mankind. Like the Shiva laser can do a whole body. Ours can only do the uh, just the base scans. Because you capture the points with the scanner, you create an digital model, like you have here, and then from there you send that to a 3D printer. Print it out of any number of different materials. Resins, plastics, metals. So there's a number of different materials you can print out. You can turn it around so you can see all the so motion capture isn't just for animating for film and television, it's used all over the world for medicine, engineering, research, biomedical analysis, etc. Now you want to get down there a little bit, see if you can push it around that little tree trunk thing. Gentle, gentle, gentle. Just wiggle it back and forth and see if you can get down into that space. You know, anything, you got to practice. The doctors spend a lot of time practicing. You see that? And if you look at this... So, this interest in science and technology uh, started very early for me. The networking stuff was the uh, kind of the ultimate uh, fascination. The idea that you could do something and something would happen 3,000 miles away okay, was absolutely, you know, just so intriguing and so like magic. The patient's own uh, MRI information that's fed into the simulator and reconstructs the uh, brain in a three-dimensional view. We actually have a simulator here. Bring it into the brain a little bit. Slowly. Yeah. So what it does is a high-frequency movement that takes out the tissue and then it suctions out the tissue as you do it. So that's what you're doing right there. The whitish bit in the middle, that's all the tumor tissue right there. And we were asked at Imagineering to do something special just for the National Academy of Engineers, just for this room. And there, there are two cameras that photograph a person and take a stereo picture. Give me a we have, out. because we are part of Disney, access to the Tron plates. So we hand you a wand, which is also calibrated to be in the 3D world. And we say, draw in your right side. But the key to our drawing is it's an absolute floating free space and you can draw your Tron cycle around your floating body and then we kind of drive it off for you. This is the ultimate aphrodisiac. I mean, it's just so much fun to make things like this happen.